Hi grade 11 is another video where we are now going to be looking at page numbers now I know some of you have some hassles with page numbers when it comes to inserting them um, when it comes to putting them on different pages you know different first page all these things so we're going to cover this in today's video so here we've got page one page two and page three and page four okay so we've got four pages of our document now just to insert page numbers we can go to the insert tab Go to page number we're going to use bottom of the page and please when they ask you for page x of y they simply referring to this page x of y over here i'm just going to select it and you can see i'm just going to close the header and footer so you can see it's in the footer bottom of the page page x of y okay so that's number one how i insert um, my page number now secondly i can go and do a few things to this i'm going to go back to the first page open this and i've got some options here the first one i can put a tick in is different first page when i put the tick in that and say close header and footer look what happens there's nothing on the first page but the numbering continues on the second page page two or four page three or four page four or four so this is how i can insert my page numbers with nothing displaying on the first page but it counts the first page as page one. Okay. Then I can go back in here and I can also say different odd and even pages. So when I put a tick in that, let's see what happens. My first page, obviously there's still nothing. My second page, there's nothing. My third page, page three or four is there and page four is not there. So all the even pages are not displaying, but the odd pages are displaying. So, with that in mind now how do we start our um, page numbers let's say from page number two okay so i'm just going to undo everything that i've put in place take out all these page numbers there's nothing there okay so what i'm going to have to do is i'm going to have to put in a section break to make sure that i'm separating this from everything else ensure okay that's page number two let's see if that is in place and okay there's my section break so that's fine i'm going to go to page two and then i'm going to insert uh, my page number bottom of the page and i'm just going to use any one and i'm going to close my header right but now we see that it's on the first page as well and it's just showing one one and then two okay so now i'm going to go back into this you can see I can just go and click in it or double click in it and say different first page close my header and footer so different first page on the first page that should take that out just take that tick out there okay so now we've got nothing on the first page then from our second page we've got one page two and page three so just make sure um you know when you put your section break in the the page number will still display here but just make sure you go in and say different first page um and then that should be fine and there you can see my page number in the starting on the second page now i can go in here and say okay you know, double click on that go to page number go to format page numbers and say I want to start at let's say number three and I want to click OK close my header and foot and you can see nothing on the first page now my numbering starts from page three page four and page five 